CBK Casey merger has happened in 2023. None of the CBK Casey units have made it through Michigan yet. Of August the 2nd, 2024, I was given word on a Facebook group on the NS Wabash line that NS 58 would dwell in Adroy, Michigan. Everybody in the Southeast Michigan well fans have known about this. By time it would be August 3rd, they have cleared up the mains at 8.30 a.m. So we make the road trip to Cone, Michigan since the well fence he will catch for today. However, we would end up getting basically five trains. This would be the first one and it's 181. He's a very late one today since the development happened the previous day and they just didn't want to take him on the Detroit line. However, 121 did and it would end up taking the Detroit line and then from Toledo to Butler he would take the Chicago line. I had some friends over in Butler, Indiana the previous night to see what they can catch and see if they would see any routes. However, 121 was the only wheel out they got. I'm not sure if this is technically P71, but I can tell you this. This, whoever it is, want like bunch of cars from Adrian to like Milan. We thought we would see the engine again going back west. We never did. It would be another two and a half hours till we get a train. But then we just wanted to chill in a car, but we would not wanted to miss anything, so I just stand outside. Very well mistaken. It's very humid outside. It's almost like 88 degrees that's how hot it was but then we get a signal for a westbound 189 finally gets a crew after five trains went by him this morning however after that local went by 189 gets the chance to leave Milan for East Point Georgia
137, but then I guess it switched from 137 to 231. But this would have the brand new CPKC unit leading the way on 231. After we would get 231 here at Milan, we decided to head over to Cone just to see what we would catch and see this 231 again. Since he crossed over, he has to stop for imposing eastbound, what I thought it would be a westbound behind him, but I was wrong. And yeah, I can definitely say I was wrong for that. We were ending up getting an eastbound. I thought this would be 120 or 188, but it would be very short for 188 and 120. 
Could this be 358, the one that dewilled and age win? After we would get that eastbound manifest here at home, it would be another 30 to 20 minutes till 231 would get a signal head west for Elkhart to get a recruit, and then after Elkhart, it would go to his final destination, Bensonville, Illinois, basically Chicago area. But it was a pleasure of seeing the new CD Casey unit since I haven't seen one before and it's been a year since the merger has happened. We've just been seeing a lot of CP Casey units like KCS combined with CP but we just never really see a CP Casey unit especially in Michigan. Getting here on time for 2.55, but we just got here too late. I guess I should have been up at 5 a.m. and then just came here by myself and just chilled here for the whole day or something. But it's whatever. Even though the era of 2.55 and 2.56 would have been over, but by the time I'm like editing this, it will be November 4th. 2024 and the new trip of crown service train will go into an wall stack train. That's kind of boring. I wish I saw the 255 this day. I'll see you guys in the Michigan or state or the Buckeye State Wells. Oh.